Welcome to another video from Costa Rica. As you can see, I'm no longer in the mountains. You can also hear it. Behind me, there's the sea. And yeah, I'm now here in Puerto Viejo at the Caribbean coast. So as I said in one of the first videos, we switched the side now. We went from the Pacific coast into the mountains where we had a car and now we're back to traveling the coast by bus. And I'm here for a few days now and it's the first real photo shoot. And there are a few reasons for that. First of all, the beaches here are not as easy to photograph as the ones at the Pacific side. First of all, there's not much tide, so the water will not wash away all the footprints you get through during the day. Also, the beaches are not that wide. So it's a lot less to explore, a lot less rocks, and also a lot less palm trees, which I find curious. So the Pacific coast was full of palm trees, which makes this very tropical and yeah, very photogenic and here it's more of those trees and yeah that's what's characteristic here are those trees which i have here in the frame those thick trees with a fix um, yeah or whatever it is so i'm no expert in trees but those trees here are very characteristic for this part of the coast and so i decided to photograph those instead of the sea which it looks a bit boring uh, during sunsets especially if there are no clouds which we don't have here in the mornings during the day there's usually a lot of clouds so you also don't get the crystal clear water which you have here so it's a uh, golden beaches and the water is really beautiful but also a lot of waves so yeah i'm not sure if i'm gonna take a photo of the coast in the next days but i still have some time but this year let's quickly talk about this composition so i found a nice framing here first of all all those roots in the foreground then this beautiful tree to the side and i have a similar tree on the other side those two are framing the shot and also they mimic each other they look similar and i think this works very well and i also get some depth because this one is closer to the camera than this one so this one is bigger than this one then we have another tree and yeah it's a repetition into the background so more, more trees and also what I was waiting for, so I shot this scene yesterday evening to test it, but I was really waiting for the sun, for the side light. So I have beautiful warm light on this tree, on the side of this tree, and in the background, it's just beautiful. And I yeah, hope it's gonna make for a nice photo, which represents what this coast is about, because you have those trees everywhere. And yeah, I thought, why not put them in a photo? Okay, so that's it for this shoot. I'm gonna show you the photo now and then we're gonna continue explore. Also, you've again seen some footage or at least a photo of a sloth. So here in this area around Porto Viejo, if you want to see a sloth, you see many here. So there are the two finger sloth, the three finger sloths, and yeah, you look up every tree and in every second or third tree, you see a sloth nearly. So you have to sometimes look a bit closer because if they're up in the trees, you just see a little furry ball, but we had the luck to see some come down and yeah doing some nice climbing action so yeah, this was really fun so yeah if you want to see sloth come to Puerto Viejo if you want to photograph beautiful beaches currently I'd rather go to the Pacific side but if you come to Costa Rica make sure to visit both as we did okay that's it for this shoot let's see what else we're gonna find So it's now afternoon and we're back at the tree I photographed this morning and yeah I want to talk a bit about the importance of working a scene which also means returning to a scene. So this morning I photographed basically in the other direction where I had some beautiful side light from the rising sun. So this photo already looked nice but I figured in the evening or in the afternoon when the sun goes down that direction I might try to include the sun in the frame and I've talked about this already in other videos. Uh, sometimes in woodland photography it's nice to have the sun star in the frame so basically directly shooting into the sun because what you get is kind of a hazy feel to the image and this is emphasized here because we have a bit of spray from the sea so you have some sunbeams sometimes showing up in the picture and yeah I wanted to make use of that so I'm now photographing again this tree have it roughly in the middle of the frame then the trees in the background and yeah you wouldn't know but just 200 meters that way there's a street with cars driving by but here at the coast yeah it feels like jungle so that's the nice thing about Costa Rica and I've 
said this in past videos. You get such scenes directly in town and yeah, it's just beautiful. And also today the sun is out, the water looked nice, crystal clear. So yeah, finally getting the Caribbean vibes here. But yeah, now let's just finish this photo and yeah, then we can compare this photo to the one I took this morning and see which one looks best.